The new petrol V8 Bentley Benga goes on sale to UK customers in March 2018. Bentley has unveiled a V8 petrol powered variant of its Benga SUV. It sits in the middle of the Benga range and will cost from £136,200 when it goes on sale to UK customers in March. Based on same VW MLB Evo platform as the Audi Q7 and using the VW Group V8 engine in the same state of tune as another sister vehicle, the Porsche Cayenne Turbo, the Bentayga Petrol V8 bridges the gap between the entry-level £135,800 V8 diesel and the range topping £162,700 W12 Petrol. The V8 petrol engine is a 4.0-liter twin-turbo unit that's also found in the Lamborghini Urus, another car that shares the VW Group's large SUV platform. The engine produces 542 bhp and 770 newton meters of torque. 0 to 62 miles per hour takes 4.5 seconds, and it reaches a top speed of 180 miles per hour, despite its hefty curb weight of 2,395 kilograms. Power is fed through an 8-speed automatic transmission and permanent 4-wheel drive with 60% of the available drive being sent to the rear wheels. Bentley states that the Bentley V8 petrol achieves 24.8 miles per gallon and emissions of 260 grams slash km CO2 on the combined cycle. To assist in this, the engine is fitted with cylinder deactivation, where it can run on four cylinders when needed. A unique feature on the Bentley V8 petrol is the optional carbon ceramic brakes which Bentley claims are the biggest ever fitted to one of its cars and, indeed, the largest front brakes ever fitted to any production car. The 10-piston front brakes measure 440 mm in diameter, which is a 40 mm increase on the Bentley's standard steel brakes. The rear carbon ceramic brakes measure 370 mm. The massive brakes produce a maximum braking torque of 6,000 Nm, according to the crew mark. They are tucked behind 21-inch wheels as standard but customers can opt for bigger 22-inch wheels or smaller 20-inch sets if they so desire. Like on the standard Bentga, air suspension is fitted on the V8 petrol variant, and the car is equipped with a choice of four different driver modes. There's hill descent control as standard too, and a switch in the boot that can lower the Bentga's suspension if required to help when loading the car. Inside, customers can choose between a 4, 5 or 7 seat configuration, while a high gloss carbon fiber finish is available on the Bentga for the first time. Bentley has also debuted its cricket ball leather interior option that finishes the cabin in a dark chestnut hue and comes with a wood trimmed steering wheel. Driver aids include adaptive cruise control, traffic sign recognition and park assist, along with infrared night vision and a head-up display. Bentley's standard infotainment system is also fitted, featuring an 8-inch touchscreen, 60GB hard drive, and for passengers in the rear, a 10.2-inch Android tablet device with 4G Wi-Fi and Bluetooth connectivity. The Bentley V8 petrol goes on sale this spring, and becomes the third model in the Bentley range. A fourth Bentley could be on its way soon as a plug-in hybrid version has been rumored for an introduction later this year, with technology likely shared with the Porsche Cayenne SE Hybrid. What are your thoughts on the new V8 Bentley? Better than the Cayenne? Let us know in the comments below.